Howdy, howdy, and hello, everybody, and welcome back to another chapter of Husky's Tales here in our Wonder World. And, as you guys can slightly see, we still have our amazing world transition thanks to the Wonder Gem back here, the Wonder Warrior Gem. Um, I told you guys last time Mr. Wolf will be kind of away for a little bit, so it is just me. It is just me today, guys. Just me. But that is okay. Um... I've been working on a few things. You guys can see over there, I kind of got my harvesting done. My farm is all newly started. And I also was organizing my swords down here. And, oh, oh, I also need to make some food too. But I wanted to make it in the kitchen. Hello, doggy. Hello, Leaf, and Emma, and Bucky. Um, I'm going to take one of you guys for a little journey today. I just don't know which one yet. Don't know which one. So you guys be good. Best one gets to go with me. So, um, you guys look at all the paintings, by the way. I was in here. Look at all this. Look at all these. All these! Ah, uh, I like them. I like that one. I think that one's my favorite. It's cool. Um, so yes guys, I got tons of wheat. Tons! Look at this. Look at this! One more gonna make some bread. We're all gonna make some bread real fast, guys. Um, let's see if I can do this right. I did not do that right. There we go. And lots of bread. And there we go. This here. And, oh. And lots of bread. There we go. So we have lots and lots of food. We shouldn't be hungry ever again, hopefully. But yes, guys. Um, that was completely random. Welcome to my kitchen. <laughs> um, I do have plans to go ahead. Um, I was going to start working on our little uh, village over there on the cliff top. But, uh, yeah, over there. But I don't have the right materials yet. I need to actually go into the nether to get them. Because I want quartz. Um, quartz is really fancy. I think that's what's called quartz. I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure it's quartz, though. Uh, is it getting... Oh, no. Um, so yes, I have to go to the nether for that stuff, but we are going to do something today, as I sniffle. Um, the little tree, it is getting dark, we're going to go sleep first, but the little tree I showed you guys last episode, I was asking you guys what to do with it, and you guys said make a tree house, and other little fun things, and so that's what we'll be doing. Um, of course, naturally guys, before we do that, I will show you who we've added to the Puppy Pal Grove, as well as announce the names for all of our amazing sheep pals. Um, it was a lot to go through. You guys were amazing. Um, let me just go take a quick nap here. You guys were amazing with your names. Like, there was just some that were so creative. I had to add, I had to add so many people today. I'm not even joking. Let me make sure I have my bones and my dirt here. Um, I got shears for the tree branches earlier. Which I'll show you guys. I did actually finish our, uh, our Lily Plaid Plop game and all the decorations on it. Let me go over here. So guys, today, like I said, I'm adding a bunch of new people, and so I'm just going to start off over here, and if I again, if I mess up anyone's names, I apologize. So I, I will be adding, um, e Ilid Ilidith, Ilidith Marin, I think, I don't know, if I said it wrong, please correct me. I'm adding Husky Tales fan, which I've been talking to you like on Twitter here and there, I see all your tweets. Uh, Stephanie Deep, and Angela Belcher, I believe it was. And you four right here, I kind of put you guys on like one on one side, the other one to finish it up. Um, you guys have been giving me, you guys gave me an amazing name for this year. Like everyone gave me amazing names. Like there's some names I kind of like took and just kind of like changed just a little bit to make it fit because these, these signposts can only hold so many letters. It's really annoying. I don't like it. No. Um, I mean, what can you do though, right? Um, I am like all like, I can't think today. I'm like jumping around I'm, like here and I'm over here and I'm there and I'm up here. Um, but yes, I wanted to, you know, thank you guys for giving me the names of the sheep and like all the little creativeness about it. So, in honor, as always, I'm going to dig up two plots. Well, not always two plots. And so, this is, I think, again, I hope I said your name right. This is for you, Elidith, hopefully. I'm going to put that in there. And then for Husky Tales fan, oh, Husky Tales fan, Stephanie, and Angela. And we're gonna bury those nice and safe right there for you guys. Let me get this extra one here. And you guys, all four of you, welcome to the Puppy Pal Grove. And thank you so much for being awesome and supporting. And if you guys are wondering, if you guys have been like, if you guys haven't been watching the series and wondering, how do I get into the Puppy Pal Grove? It's super simple. You guys just gotta draw, or you guys gotta talk, or you guys gotta comment, or share, or like all that fun stuff. Um, if you guys draw me something, uh, I love seeing those kind of things. If you guys tell me funny jokes, uh, there's someone that wrote me a poem that will be added maybe in the next few days. Hint, hint. Um, I have like a lot of people to add my signs. I do. Um, so yes, you guys, drawings, poems, 
jokes, comments, especially like sharing my stuff on like the on the doggy book Twitter and the Facebooks and all that. I love seeing that kind of stuff because when you share it, it lets me know I'm worth sharing. So thank you again to those four, and we and we know welcome to the Puppy Pal Grove. Now, as I said, we are going to go ahead and start working on the little tree area. I need to get some supplies first, though. Um, I also want to show you guys the names of the sheep, too, as well as the finish. This might just be like a let's look what's going on kind of thing. Um, so, yeah, let me get the wood first, just in case. So, we get ladders here. Get spruce. Grab some oak to be safe. Um, take some torches. We'll take some birch and just, just to be safe, too. I don't think we'll need fences. Uh, there's some spruce cake. <clears throat> I clear my throat again. I'm getting a weird tickle in my throat. I don't know if I'm getting sick again or not, but I really hope not. So, like I said, you guys, I can see I kind of... I did all my farming before the video. Make sure all that was out of the way. And we're just going to hop over here, guys. I want to show you guys all the names of the amazing sheep and dandelions family that we have. Close this. The doors are so squeaky! The emerald made, the emerald made the door so squeaky in this. Um, oh, yes. Hello, everyone. So yes, guys, we are going to start from the very beginning and announce the names. We have Rose, who's the red sheepy over there. Lion, who's the orange sheep over there. You guys all know Dandelion. Dandelion was our first one, huh, Dandelion? Huh, huh. Um, Spring, who's, I, I don't have, Spring is hiding. He doesn't have his coat yet. Same as Forest, uh, who's green. And then Cyan, who's, or Flake, who is Cyan. Um, I don't have their colors yet, so they're in there. They're just hiding. For light blue, we have Barry, which is, where is Barry? Oh, there's Barry. Barry's back there. And then, of course, for blue, we have Luna right there. Hello, lady. Hello, miss. Um, purple, we have Lilac, which is over there, I think. And then magenta, we have Eggplant, which is, I think, that one. Pink, we have Cotton Candy right there. And brown, we have Maple, which I don't have brown yet either. That's another coat. Um, we have our duckies friends here. Hello, Nugget. You guys are ducks right now because of my because of what the emerald did to our world. So hello, duckies. Hello, ducks. Um, and then we have Clover. Hello, Clover. How are you doing today? I need to get you another friend soon. Oh yes. <clears throat> I hope I'm not getting sick. I really don't want to get sick, guys. That would not be fun. Um, so yes, that was all of our fun names. Thanks, you guys, to everyone who suggested stuff. I loved all the names. It was really hard to go through them all and figure out what to do. Um, there's a tree that we're going to be working on, guys. But before I do that, I wanted to come and show you the finished um, uh, lily pad plop game we did. And hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys thought about the game, by the way. And if you guys have any other game suggestions, let me know. I have like one or two I'm going to be doing, but I'm going to keep those a secret. You guys have to guess. Oh, so here it is, guys. I'm like walking past. I'm like, la 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 la. Uh, I did actually get the trees, like I said. And I have like all the vines, which someone did suggest. Thank you. Oh, we put a chest here, so we have all of our stuff in. We got snow and lily pads and such. That took forever to get that snow. We had, I made Mr. Wolf stay a little longer to help me get it. And we have all of our grass up here. So yes, guys, we have our lily pad plop game all nice and fresh right here. Fresh. Like it's freshly made food. Uh, I don't know why I said fresh. But we have it all finished here. That's what I meant to say. Um, it was a super fun game. I want to play more of it in the future. So I need to like... I need to like make a way to like make a separate little portal or ask the emerald to make me a world where I can recreate my mini games and have you guys play with me. You guys play with me. Cause I mean who would love to who who wouldn't want to play Lily Pad Plop with me? Seriously. If you guys would like to play Lily Pad Plop, say something, because I would love to play that game with you guys. <clears throat> Ugh. Sorry. That was not very attractive, was it? No. I'm supposed to be a gentleman, Husky. Hmm, of the finest degree in purebred. I don't know why I'm talking like that. I do that a lot. All right, guys, here we are. The tree. This is our tree. Um, you guys can see it's like uh, three of them in one or something. Um, I'm going to make a little path or staircase to it, I think, kind of up here. Um, I did put torches down. I was exploring briefly earlier. Oh, it's a cow. I was like, what is that? It's a cow. It's a, is that a cave? That's a cave. Oh, we have to look. We have, there's a lot of things I need to do, actually. So, yeah. I don't know quite how I want to do this. Like, I want to make it a tree house just for fun. Like, just to make, you know, something silly. Until I can get the nether and get the quartz I need for our town. This will be, like, a temporary little fun thing to do. So, I guess I'm just going to kind of... I just kind of want to build up right there. So, let me get this out of the way. Um, where's our ladders? So, get ladder here, here, 
here. I also just noticed the ladder has like a little piece broken in it. I like that. Uh, there we go. Um, I did not bring an axe with me, so uh, we're gonna have to stand here and punch wood. Yay! Um, so tell me, guys, how are you all doing? Because I'm gonna be punching this for a while. I am not a strong husky without my pickaxe and my sword and stuff. I don't want to use my sword. Oh, there we go. All right. I guess I should have kind of brought something considering I was going to be. Oh, where's my shears? Um, because I was getting leaves and stuff earlier. I want to make sure I actually get. Oh wow, this is a cool tree actually. Wow, this is really cool. Um, yeah, if you guys noticed, it, it's green in my inventory, but it's orange when I put it out. It's kind of cool. Eh. Ow. Oh, I didn't fall. Oh, okay, I did fall, but I didn't fall much. I need to go get an axe. <laughs> oh, apple, apple. Um, so yeah, basically what I'm thinking, guys, is you'll climb up here. There'll be a door or something here, maybe. Like right here. I'll just punch this wood. And then basically it's going to be like a little platform. Oh, the shears are actually working really fast. That's, that's good, actually. I didn't know how to do that. Shears, guys. I just found this out. Shears work really well on trees. Did you guys know that? Because I didn't. Because um, look at this. Look. It actually goes pretty fast. I'm sure it probably, like, ow! <laughs> I'm sure it probably uh, wears out the shears' durability a bit, but that's okay. Now let me get rid of this. And let me get rid of this. Move on like this. I can't take rid of, I don't want to get rid of all of them, though, because I'm scared I'll lose the branches and stuff, because I like the branches. Um, so yeah, basically, guys, we'll climb up here. And I think we'll have like little like planks and stuff. Here, let's get this. There we go. Um, we'll have like planks going here and here, and well, this far. And then we also need to go. Um, I also have to get rid of some of this stuff too. So yeah, this is gonna be a little tree house, guys. Um, if you guys have a name for our tree house, that would be cool. Give our give our tree house a name, guys. I don't know what we're gonna do with it. It's just gonna be a fun little place to. I need those blocks. Eh. Eh, climb down, climb down, climb down. I got this. Eh, eh, run over, run over. Okay, um, I'm gonna have to be doing a lot of running to collect the blocks and stuff. Uh, but yes, guys, if you guys have a cool little name for our treehouse, let me know. Um, somebody suggested to make it a museum. I definitely love that idea. I kind of want to make like a block museum, but I don't know if I'll have the room. Ow, ouch, ow. <laughs> I fall, I fell, and it hurt. Um,. Okay, this time I won't fall, I promise. I'm just I'm just having bad luck today. It's going to be one of those kind of days. See? See? I placed a block on a block. Ah, uh, it's going to be one of those kind of things. And I wonder if shears work just as well on planks. Eh, decent. An axe is obviously the best thing for it, though. And I'm going to go put two here. So I don't block the ladder, but I also have, like, a clear path. And then... I'm going to go... Oh. Oh, there you go. Here. Eh. These shears work... I'm just kind of like destroying all of them here. I need to, I want to replace one of these. I don't want like giant gaps in the uh, tree. And there we go. And then we're going to go there. Okay. Um, so I'm trying to figure out exactly what we're going to do. Am I, is the tree fading? Or am I just finding random like apples and sprigs? Because it seems like the, it's like fading as I'm doing this. Like I'm working on. Whoa, look. Oh, look at that. The emerald made our moon into a cool little planet. Oh, that, that, that's cool. I just want to watch it now. Can we just sit here for like a few minutes and just stare at the moon? That's a very dog thing to do, right? I'm allowed to do that? That's really cool. I know there's a few times back it was a red moon. I thought that was just, you know, red moon. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Um, so I'm going to go over here really fast. Um, and yeah. Just destroy all those. Um, okay, this right here, this right here. I don't want to destroy too much of the tree, but I do want to like make it kind of a tree house feel. So I don't know. Uh, I'm gonna have to like obviously make the ceiling higher. I don't like low ceilings. I've never have like the one block ceilings. It's it's weird. I know, but Oop, there we go. Eh, eh, there we go. Um, I just don't like low ceilings. It makes me feel like I'm trapped. Who else agrees? Do you guys do you guys like low ceilings or high ceilings? That's a witch. There's witches. Uh, I don't know about you two. I'm gonna stay away from you guys. Don't want no trouble. Ow! See, I hurt myself enough as it is. I don't need creepers and witches and other things coming to hurt me too. Um, I 
So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and keep working on this, guys. Uh, try to figure out exactly how I want to do it, cause I had an idea, but now that I'm actually up here, I'm realizing that it might not work quite as well as I had thought it would. So I don't know. We'll have to see how well this works. Cause if you get rid of the tree and then like the leaves disappear and yeah. So I'm going to go ahead and go here and here. This is like a really weird tree too, first of all. Um, this is pretty good actually. Here, that one. And we'll put a grass block here. Do it here. Um, I guess maybe like here. There, maybe. There we go. Okay. I'm going to need a lot more leaves. I'm going to have to go take leaves from other trees, I think. I will leave a small window there. Why not? Uh, window of leaves. There we go. And then we're going to go there, there, go, oh, there, there. There we go. I kind of want this to be a bigger window almost. I don't know. So yeah, I'm like trying to sit here and figure out how I want to do it as I'm going. It's kind of like a work in progress. Like it was such a random idea. Like I was like, I love it. So I'm going to kind of just work on it and build it and see what happens. Um, if you guys have any suggestions, perhaps, about what I should be doing with the treehouse, let me know. Because for now, I think this is kind of what it's going to look like until I can figure out more. But, uh, yeah, guys, this is our little fun treehouse. Be sure to give it a name. I don't know what to name it. We're going to have to find some cool little name for it. Um, and if you guys have any hints or, like, tips on what I should do with it, let me know. Like, should I add, like, certain rooms? Should I add certain rooms made out of leaves or wood? Should I get rid of the planks and go with normal wood? I don't know. So you guys watch it. Oh, hiccup. <laughs> you guys watching this, let me know what you guys are thinking. And in the comments below, down here somewhere, down here, make sure to let me know what you guys are thinking, what I should do, maybe make things fancy or not. I do for sure know this is going to need torches because it is kind of dark in this room. Let me uh, do that real fast. Yeah, there we go. Right there. I don't think you can put them on leaves. No, you can't. Okay. So anyways, as I was saying, I'm getting really distracted to you guys. Um, yes. Um, thank you guys for watching, by the way. This will be our little... I think we're going to end it here, like I said. Or, if I didn't say it, I'm saying it now. If you guys are liking what you guys are seeing, like, share, and comment, all that stuff down below here. Um, be sure to, you know, let everyone know what you're thinking. Let me know what you guys are thinking, about, especially about the treehouse. And again, welcome to all of our new puppy pals in the Grove. All you guys are amazing. Everyone, even if I didn't add your name, you are amazing people. Ah, amazing. Um... I'm going to keep babbling here. I have a horrible habit of babbling. I'm trying to get better. I promise. But yes, guys. We are going to keep trying to work on the treehouse. Give me suggestions of what we should do and what little things we should add. And if you guys aren't aware, we are so, so close to 1,000 Puppy Pals. So be sure to share and hit that like button and comment and all that fun stuff. And I'll be sure to see you guys in the next chapter. Bye!